Good morning YouTube. So with today's video, let's talk about the brand of Mercedes-Benz. At the start of this year, I did state that I'm going to be doing more videos from this brand. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Mercedes-Benz Man Grey. So they have like, I don't know, I think half a dozen fragrances that are in the shape of this. And the bottle itself, ooh, it's tough to get off. I believe it's supposed to be like like the keychain of a Mercedes-Benz. So I think like Mercedes-Benz, like you just press the button and the key just pops up, pops up at the top. I believe that's what it's supposed to be. All right. So this fragrance was actually launched in 2018 and it's classed as an amber spicy. So the note breakdown for this one here, top notes are going to be pink pepper and citruses with the meat being sage, olibanum, but also ambroxan. And the base is going to be gurgeon, balsam, uh, amberwood, but also musk. So what do I get from this fragrance here? I've been wearing this one for the last uh, week. Now, in the opening, you, you are going to get some citruses, but also a very nice pink pepper. The pink pepper does add a little bit of warmth to it, but this fragrance does become a little bit more warmer with that olibanum. I per se don't get olibanum, but I do get a bit of a resinous undertone with it. You're also going to get lots of ambroxum in the opening as well. The ambroxum itself does add a lot of freshness and it does add a little bit of an airiness. This fragrance, however, does add, it does become, I should say, a little bit more airy with the amber wood when it kicks in. It's a very ambery scent with musk and a woody base. If you don't like musk or amber wood or just amber, like a fragrance that contains a lot of musk and a lot of amber, this is one that you might not like. Originally, I thought that this is going to be more of a warmer season fragrance, or I should say a spring and summer fragrance, because it is a fresh fragrance in the opening because of that ambroxan. When I'm thinking of ambroxan, I'm thinking of like Dior Sauvage and fragrances that kind of go along those lines. This is more of a fall to spring fragrance. Now, in the wintertime, but spring when it's colder out, like the transition from winter to spring. This is also a very versatile fragrance that I do find is actually quite signature scent worthy for someone who's 35 or you know what, 30 and up. I just find that this is what a grown man smells like. More so a dad. I find that this is a dad's fragrance. It has maturity, there's a little bit of class and elegance to it, and it does smell like someone who has a little bit of life experience as well. And this itself is a prime work scent in my opinion. This is a great office fragrance even though I do state that it is a pretty versatile fragrance. It's a signature scent really. Longevity off this was 7 to 8 hours and projection was more moderate. And price tag for this, Mercedes does a lot of great fragrances at a good price tag. You can get a tester bottle for like about $35 or like $36, $38 Canadian. And I've seen this all the way up to $70, $75 Canadian. So when you convert that, that, that tester bottle price tag, so we'll say 35, that's like 28 bucks USD. And when you convert like the $70, let's say, that's like $58, $59 USD. I think that's great bang for your buck. I didn't ask the wife's thoughts on this one, but in the end, we're just gonna keep this review short. This is a fragrance that I find is great for the everyday man. Someone who just doesn't want a lot of fragrances in their, in their collection. It's a great office fragrance. It's a great day-to-day -day casual fragrance. It's just a, a great everyday fragrance during the colder times. Longevity is great. It's a great bang for your buck. It's not gonna break the bank. And again, this just smells like what like a dad should be. And that is my quick little review of Mercedes Man's Grey. So what videos to watch next? Well, why don't you check out this corner here. And before you go, please make sure to give me one of these as I really would appreciate it. I will be doing more videos of, uh, of this brand. I'm actually wearing Mercedes Benz Man uh, Private, I believe it is. So I'm gonna be doing a collaboration with uh, on this one here. So stay tuned for that one. And any other reviews that I've done from this brand, they will all be in the description box below. Everyone, I thank you for your time, take care, and I will see you later. Thanks for watching, everyone.